yeah, uh, Gordon Ramsay and actually a bunch of other restauranteurs, you know, moguls like Guy Fieri and blah, 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 have pretty much all at the same time came out with their own frozen foods that you can microwave, put in the oven, air fry. It's actually kind of interesting. They have a huge selection. When I went to go check these out a couple weeks ago, they still had them there, and I thought it'd be kind of fun to try it out for a mukbang. Now, what we're trying tonight is actually a handful of them that sounded pretty okay, like, um, uh, well, not okay, but interesting, I guess, to try, like a frozen macaroni and cheese prepared by, it says there, Gordon Ramsay himself. We are also going to try some beef wellington and also some pizza rolls, pizza bites, whatever they want to call them. I'm super excited, so make sure you guys, of course, like, 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 like the video. If you do like this video idea, there are a bunch of other ones we can try. If you want to try a Guy Fieri branded one, hey, we'll do a Guy Fieri frozen food one next. Or maybe if you guys want me to actually do a real Gordon Ramsay meal, hey, maybe if you guys really like this video, you know, obviously by liking the video and just doing what you guys gotta do, maybe I'll actually go to like a Hell's Kitchen and actually eat at a Gordon Ramsay restaurant for an IRL ASMR mukbang. Now that could be a very fun idea. Okay, 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 so the first thing that we're actually gonna try tonight, which actually might be, I guess, technically the appetizer, the appetizer of the meal. It, it's gonna be frozen macaroni and cheese pie, of course, your boy Chef Ramsay. Uh, very interesting. Yes, uh, this is, I guess, what it actually looks like, which I am kind of terrified. Now, obviously, it's been sitting for a little bit because I, you know, set up the camera, made sure everything was okay. I've never had microwaveable mac and cheese before. So this is my first time ever. The macaronis are huge. It's like a white pasta. Anyways, uh, cheers. see this or not, but pretty much it's just macaroni, pasta, 
to be the ultimate indulgence one of my all-time favorite main courses and it would definitely be on my last supper menu kind of it's a beef wellington bite um they are just i'm assuming mini beef wellington and uh again i've eaten these before at the official like hell's kitchen gordon ramsay restaurant <clears throat> show you what they look like um it's you know 
because it's gonna go do a very gross little soft thing there because it's just literally beef in a puff pastry but it's nothing uh, to really be super excited about uh, I think in the original beef wellington it's like a it's like a steak basically wrapped in, in like a you know a puff pastry I think that's what they call it it's not that this is a uh, mystery meat wrapped in a I don't know a Pillsbury like regular biscuit you know those croissants you get at the store um, it's like one of those anyways <sighs> okay let's uh, compare this thing to the real thing Pretty good, but 
I've never had it before. I never will. Uh, I'm not going to go back to it, but the taste of this mac and cheese is like, I don't want to say one of the best tasting I've ever had, but that was a really good tasting mac and cheese. Like, it tasted like, you know, a four cheese or however many cheese, like nice restaurant macaroni and cheese. You add some salt, pepper, maybe if the bread comes worked microwaved. It would actually be kind of nice if the cheese wasn't so clumpy and, again, microwaved. If it was very gooey like that, that would have been, oh, like, again, like a restaurant-style mac and cheese I would have been very happy with. But it's not. It's very clumpy. Um, you know, the, the texture of the cheese and the macaroni, as soon as you take a bite out of it, is just gross. It's not good. It feels disgusting while eating. But the taste, the taste is good. So that's like more than half the battle. So that's why it's not too bad, I guess. Uh, I, I guess I would recommend it for you to try. And of course, the best thing that we tried today was the pizza bites. The pizza bites, the pizza bites, the pizza rolls, whatever you want to call it. Those are fire. So uh, now rating this meal on a scale of 1 to 10, the Jake Baller official scale. probably give this like a 6 out of 10. Um, yeah. I know I was kind of maybe hyping that up a little bit while going into the rating, but it's still frozen food. Like, it's still just frozen food, migrate food, cooked in the oven for 20 minutes, food. But is it above average than any of the other migratable foods? Yes, this is probably better than any microwaved food that you could probably find on the shelves right now. Uh, everything about it was probably the best of a microwaved frozen meal that you could get. But that still is a frozen meal. That's not the greatest. So, you know, I'm not going to rate it super high. It's still not the best. It's definitely overpriced. Like, this stuff was overpriced. Like, I think altogether those three things cost me like 15 they're almost like five, six bucks a box, which is insane for, again, a, you know, frozen meal, cheap meal, eat at home very quickly meal. Kind of insane. Hopefully you guys enjoyed um, that. That was really fun. Now, uh, I've done Gordon Ramsay fish and chips. I've done Gordon Ramsay frozen meals. Maybe one of these days I'll head out to Las Vegas again and do a mukbang in public and actually eat at the restaurant with you guys, whether it's Gordon Ramsay Burger, Gordon Ramsay's Hell's Kitchen, Gordon Ramsay Bub and Grill. There's a lot of Gordon Ramsay restaurants out there, but maybe next time I'll go out there and try the real deal with you guys. If you guys want that, if you really, really want that, show some love on this video. Anyways, I love you. Love you, love you, love you. And I hope to see you again in another video very, 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 very soon. Alright, guys.